Hi, I'm Evelyn with the Eugene Agogo News Team, and we're here at the Eugene Agogo Float uh, with Karen Rainsong, um, the Director of Arts and the Business Alliance. Um, can you tell me what's uh, happening with this float? Well, we're really excited. This is our first year doing a float for Create Eugene and Eugene Agogo together. So we're pulling a big giant canvas wall and we've got stunt painters that are coming on board to paint and hop off every 15 minutes and some more stunt painters on. So we'll have live art making in action right here being pulled through the parade. So we're hoping to really inspire people to check out Eugene Gogo and check out the Create Eugene Festival happening here in August. We've had a whole bunch of workshops, a lot of visitors, a plein air paint out. We only have about a week left of the Create Eugene Festival, so we're really hoping to make a big splash in this last week. So it's going to be a blast today. All right, well, let's get to the parade. All right, thanks. Hi, I'm Tyler with Eugene Gogo, and I'm talking with Daniel Balter, and he's one of the uh, Eugene Gogo and Create Eugene float stunt painters, as he calls himself. So um, what are you working on today? We're going to be working on this wall and we're using acrylic latex house paint so it will dry very quickly. We've got some big brushes, some bright colors and very excited to be part of the fair. We're going to, we will be painting over each other's work though so no one will get precious and it's not about a finished artwork but about the process. So you're going to be creating and destroying and creating again art on this white canvas here as you travel down the parade line. That's Is right. Is that true? Like ab abstract expressionist movement. Kind of like that, but abstract expressionist meets Eugene. That's wonderful. You're one painter. How many other painters are there involved in this project? Innumerable. 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 And, uh, you know, everyone wearing one of these t-shirts is probably a painter, except for the driver. So there's probably about seven of us or so. It'll be enough, believe me. We, get, we each get about 15 minutes. And do you so. have any ideas about what you're going to do going into it, or is it completely off the cuff? Well, you know, I thought about that. I thought, should I plan something out ahead of time? But I'm just going to go with it. I'm going to look at a can of color and do the Jackson Pollock thing where I just say, okay, very extemporaneous. So you're just going to hit the ground running and see what comes out of your head. That's right. It's basically. exciting. Yeah, That's great. Totally. And so you have experience um, with mural painting, you said? Yeah, I've painted murals, Shasta Middle School and other places, and um, fairly large oil paintings. And uh, I teach classes and workshops. So. And do you have a, a website or something like that? Yeah, it's uh, just my name. If someone Googled my name, Daniel Balter, there'd be a lot of stuff popping up. So Go, go and make art. You don't have to be part of the float to, uh, to go out there and express yourself. Grab some paint and brushes. It's fairly cheap. So it's exciting. Art, art.